The following installation guidelines will help you to install the Garbarook XD compatible cassette correctly to ensure the best possible performance. Installation of XD driver body compatible cassette requires tightening two different lock rings, so please refer to the installation steps that will follow for installing the cassette you just purchased. To install Garbarook XD compatible cassette, you will need a Garbarook inner lock ring tool that comes with every cassette a torque wrench with 24mm wrench socket and a cassette lock ring removal tool. We recommend using the cassette lock ring removal tool with guide pin that will not allow you to strip the lock ring threads while tightening it. Step 1. Clean the dust and mud from the free hub splines and threads. Step 2. Remove the outer cassette lock ring, unscrewing it in a counterclockwise direction if necessary, hold the inner lock ring with your hand. Step 3. Put the cassette on the driver body splines. A cassette, unlike the free hub body, has keyless splines and you can install it on the free hub in any position. However, make sure to check whether the cassette is fitted securely and tightly on the splines. Misaligned cassette placement on the driver body may damage the cassette as well as the driver body. Step 4. While holding the cassette, fully insert the Garbarook inner lock ring tool in the inner lock ring threads. Please make sure that the tool is fully inserted in the threads, otherwise you can damage the tool or the lock ring itself. Using 24mm range socket, turn the inner lock ring tool in clockwise direction Maximum torque we recommend applying is 45 newton meters. Step 5. After that, you will need to tighten the outer lock ring. Insert the outer lock ring and screw it clockwise by hand until it's securely tightened. Make sure the outer lock ring is screwed correctly and tighten it with a removal tool. Maximum torque we recommend applying is 40 newton meters. Be careful, since applying too much force when tightening the lock ring may damage its threads and make it impossible to use the cassette properly. After going through the steps, the cassette is installed and ready for operation.